You mean the lesbian girlfriend thing. Since I was, uh, you know, a young man, uh, I've been mentally ill and I, I get stigmatized, right? And lesbians get stigmatized because Americans are ignorant, so we partner. Beyond the oxygen, there's, uh, like, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, gracious sakes, you know I'm living my life the way I do. I mean, I'm carrying this broken, broken guitar that represents uh, my broken life. This man's saving these two trees, which, yeah. Well, actually, they're going to cut that one down and save this one. Okay. I mean, why can't they spend the money that it would cost to take it down to try to save it? I know, right? $20,000 is what they said it was going to cost. They don't have the will. They don't have the will. They could. They got the money. They got money and try to save the tree. Right. They got the money. They don't have the will. That's always the, that's always the way. Here, let me get out of this lady's way. Huh. This tree is getting cut down. It was on the news. I am kind of the media. I, I'm radical media in Huntsville. I've got a good following, but like, you know, I'm so fringe. Uh, but they're starting to pay attention to my current channel. That's why it's like, hey, let's bring attention to the issues like this tree's getting cut down. It's a beautiful tree. It this neighborhood will be much hotter because of the radiant heat off of the pavement. It just there's all sorts of reasons not the shade, to do it. In the shade is up to twenty five degrees cooler. Thank you. And so and uh it's not easy to live in the south. You guys saw on my feet I got heat stroke recently because we need more shade. Uh, yeah, it's an important issue. There's a tree over on Ryson that I love. I thought they had cut down, and I was like, my heart hurt. But I found it today, and I was like, oh, good, so they didn't. But this tree, we're about to lose. So, oh, man, I can hear them coming. I, I grew up in Baltimore City. I can feel the things that are approaching me, wh whether it's a car, a person. But, uh, yeah, there's a lot in this town that if people knew they would probably do something about, and this is one of those things. Well, I mean, you know, it's, it's, it, it should concern everybody. Yeah, Because yeah. even if they plan to tree back, okay, right. it's going to take 100, 150 years for it to reach. Uh-huh. You know. Undoing that much growth right. is is it's detrimental. What, you know, the oxygen that that tree puts out. Yeah. The carbon dioxide that it removes from the air. All the good it does for this neighborhood, we're just going to cut out it's gone. for aesthetics. It's gone. Instead of taking the money and trying to save the tree, they're just going to spend the money and cut the tree down. Of course, there's always money and a lack of willpower. It's, it's not that they don't have the money, they got the money. It's that they don't want to save a tree. Morning. Uh, yeah, uh, dude, you're doing the good work, and I'll, I'll make sure people see it. I'll make sure a, a, a lot more people see it. Uh huh. I'll tell you what. Uh huh. That's all. That's what I'm saying. Like, uh, uh, their uniforms do not impress me. You know, we we have to fight for what is correct. I'm taking on Corps of Engineers. Sure. I made a point with the Game of Wildlife people just recently. <laughs> they came ganging in on me. People uh, are always trying to figure out what I am. I just like beam laser beams of love at every human being that I see. And I've got this new partner who is awesome. I trust her so much. I handed her my phone. I was like, you, you're you the host now. You're the guest host of my Dude, you have no idea. You have no idea how much help it was. You're like right behind me. But uh, no, in front of me. But like, you have no idea. Yeah, I wanted that bottle so bad. Scary Jerry West here, just hanging out with my friends. How are you, huh? You doing good? How about you? You doing good? You look pretty. You look pretty. You look pretty mean, but you're a sweetie. We know it. This one's a sweetie. You're a sweetie. Look at you. Oh, don't run away. Oh, come on. Whatever. Anyway, it's courtship and these guys here are apparently grandfathered in. The BBC was getting tired of, like, there were too many Muskogees in this spot. So, like, Webbs and I teamed up to, like, catch a few and get them out of here. <laughs> You know, you don't want stragglers downtown, do you?